The Abu Dhabi royal family, also known as the Al Nayyan family, is the ruling dynasty of the Emirate of Abu Dhabi, the largest and wealthiest emirate in the United Arab Emirates. The Al Nayyan family has ruled Abu Dhabi since the 18th century and has played a pivotal role in the history and development of the UAE. The origins of the Al Nayyan family can be traced back to the Bani Yas tribal confederation, one of the largest and most powerful tribal groupings in the Arabian Peninsula. The Bani Yas were a nomadic people who roamed the deserts of what is now the UAE, Saudi Arabia, and Oman. In the late 18th century, the Al Bufjala subsection of the Bani Yas, led by Maktoum bin Shabib al Nayyan, settled in the oasis of Abu Dhabi on the shores of the Persian Gulf. Maktoum bin Shabib al Nayyan is considered the founder of the modern day Abu Dhabi royal family. He established the Al Nayyan as the ruling family of Abu Dhabi and his descendants have continued to rule the emirate ever since. Over the course of the 19th and early 20th centuries, the Al Nayyan consolidated their power and extended their influence throughout the region. In 1818, Shakbit bin Dayab Al Nayyan became the ruler of Abu Dhabi. During his 80 year reign, he oversaw the growth and development of Abu Dhabi from a small fishing village into a regional power. Shakbit bin Dayab forged close ties with the British Empire, which was expanding its influence in the Persian Gulf at the time. In 1835, Abu Dhabi became a British protectorate, with the Al Nayyan rulers agreeing to British control over the Emirates' foreign affairs. Shakbit bin Dayab was succeeded by his son, Zayed bin Khalifa Al Nayyan, in 1909. Zayed bin Khalifa, known as Zayed the Great, is considered one of the most important figures in Abu Dhabi's history. He oversaw a period of modernization and economic development, using the emirate's growing oil wealth to build infrastructure, schools, and healthcare facilities. Zayed the Great was a skilled diplomat who strengthened Abu Dhabi's ties with both the British and other Gulf states. After Zayed the Great's death in 1909, the Al Nayyan family entered a period of infighting and instability. Zayed's sons, including Khalifa bin Zayed al Nayyan and Sultan bin Zayed al Nayyan, vied for control of Abu Dhabi. This power struggle was exacerbated by the discovery of oil in Abu Dhabi in 1958, which dramatically increased the wealth and strategic importance of the emirate. In 1966, Sheikh Zayed bin Sultan al Nayyan emerged as the undisputed ruler of Abu Dhabi. Zayed bin Sultan, the third son of Zayed the Great, is regarded as the founding father of the United Arab Emirates. He played a pivotal role in uniting the seven emirates, Abu Dhabi, Dubai, Sharjah, Ayman, Amal Quain, Ras al Khaimah, and Fujairah, into a single federal state in 1971. As the first president of the UAE, Zayed bin Sultan oversaw a period of rapid economic growth and development, transforming the UAE from a relatively poor backwater into one of the wealthiest and most influential countries in the world. Zayed bin Sultan al Nayyan ruled Abu Dhabi and the UAE until his death in 2004. He was succeeded as ruler of Abu Dhabi and president of the UAE by his son, Khalifa bin Zayed al Nayyan. Khalifa bin Zayed has continued the modernization and development of Abu Dhabi, overseeing the construction of ambitious infrastructure projects the growth of the emirate's oil and gas industry, and the diversification of the economy into sectors like tourism, aviation, and finance. The Al Nayyan family wields immense power and influence, not just in Abu Dhabi and the UAE, but across the Middle East and globally. They control the majority of the UAE's vast oil wealth and have used this to build a modern, stable, and prosperous state. The family's power is underpinned by a web of strategic alliances, business interests, and personal relationships that extend far beyond the borders of the UAE. Despite their wealth and power, the Al Nayyan have sought to present themselves as benevolent, modernizing rulers who are committed to the development and well-being of the Emirati people. They have invested heavily in education, healthcare, and infrastructure, and have positioned the UAE as a hub of innovation, tourism, and international business. However, the Al Nayyan's rule has also been criticized by human rights groups for its restrictions on political dissent, freedom of expression, and the rights of migrant workers. The family maintains a tight grip on power and has been accused of crushing any challenges to its authority. Overall, 
The Abu Dhabi royal family remains one of the most influential and important dynasties in the Middle East. Their control over the UAE's vast oil wealth and their strategic geopolitical position have made them central players on the global stage. The future of the Al Nayyan family's rule will have significant implications not just for the UAE, but for the wider region and the world.